sexting is a growing problem among American teens, and many of them don't know they could face child porn charges for sending each other naked pictures of themselves. CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen shows us many of them are turning to secret apps to hide those pictures from their parents. I know people have gone busted. 11th grader Ryan Nativood says he's known about kids sexting or sharing nude pictures of one another since the sixth grade. It's degrading. It's terrible. It's much easier to do nowadays with so-called photo vault apps like this one that disguises itself as a working calculator. But punch in a code and you can stash or view whatever you want to hide. It's not cool for both for the person who has the picture and for the person who's the who the picture is taken up. Legal experts say there's no law in this country that allows people who send pictures from their phone to go out and pull them off the internet once they've been posted. And that's certainly a concern is letting uh, individuals know that they might not be able to control the dissemination of information, so they need to be the first safeguard. Parents and kids are talking about this because of what happened at a school in Colorado, where students were caught collecting and trading nude pictures, and the kids could face felony child pornography charges. Larry Gold says he has his son walking through what's on his phone about once a week. I wouldn't say I review every single app, but I'm mindful of what he's doing and what he's doing with his phone. Ryan Nativood says sexting is just not worth the trouble because a friend at school was recently busted. I warned him, others warned him, you know, it's not good to delete it. It's not, it's not something to be proud of. In Beverly Hills, Jeff Nguyen, CBS2 News.